If you like our video, click the subscribe button to subscribe to our channel and get easy access to new content. To see our full suite of ad-free video courses and training materials, visit us at teachucomp.com. To expand and show a report's filter settings after opening its customized report pane in QuickBooks Online if needed, click the Filter Sections label. The specific filters available change based on the report you are customizing. However, the way you apply filters is shared by almost all reports. Report filters restrict which data appears in the report based on the filtering criteria you choose. To apply a filter in the filter section, check the checkbox next to the filter's name to apply it. The filter then moves above a dividing line that appears in this section. Then use the Applied Filters adjacent drop-down or field to select or enter the filter's value or values. For drop-down filters, you can often select a type of filter to apply at the top of the drop-down menu. Alternatively, you can also often select specific values in the drop-down menu by checking the checkbox or checkboxes next to the specific value or values to show. You can also often check the Select All checkbox to select all the filter choices if desired. You can uncheck a checked filter choice in the drop-down menu to remove it from the report filter. For filters that use a field instead of a drop-down, you must type the value defined into the adjacent Filters field. To remove an applied filter from a report in QuickBooks Online within the Filters section of the Customized Report pane, uncheck the checkbox next to the filter's name in the list of applied filters shown above the dividing line in this section. When you apply multiple filters to a report, data in the report must match all the applied filters to appear in the report. Remember to click the subscribe button to see more of our videos. Get ad-free courses at teachucomp.com.